guys, it's Farmer Brad here, and I have the yard bird chicken plucker right here. I decided to do some on-farm chicken processing and looked all across the internet, and this was the brand that a lot of people had great things to say about it. So uh, I'm gonna try to put this together and see how it goes. There's the motor, here's some wheels. It just feels very good uh, construction, very industrial. So now let's uh, dive into these instructions. says start with the wheels. These are small little cute wheels, I do have to say. So those of you that may not know uh, Chicken Plucker, the goal of the Chicken Plucker is to easily take the feathers off the bird. Um, there's a whole bunch of these little rubber fingers on here and as it spins around after you've scalded the bird in water that's about 150 to 160 degrees, then help take the feathers off. And these right here are the wheel axles. So in here we're looking for a nut in a washer. So here's the washer, here's the nut. I'm just going to hand tighten it for right now. Okay, then here are small
I ended up finally getting the right tool. Tighten all of those up. Now I can carefully flip this over. Now I went ahead and uh, made a mistake. I should not have connected these yet. Slide that off. So now to take this plate out, place that in there with a the key. Place this back on there and line up those hooks. There's ones in the back. There we go. Then make sure to put these uh, carabiners back on. So here is the power cord, and I'm pretty sure that these hooks were only in there for shipping, and uh, then right here is a garden hose adapter, and that sprays water down in here as it uh, spins around. So this is what the inside looks like. Here's the garden hose adapter is over here. And then as this uh, spins around, the chicken, I think you can have up to two in here at a time and it will start spinning around. And then there's a hole in the bottom where the feathers will get shoved out. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, it was a little clunky to put together, but it was partly because I was using the wrong tools. I definitely recommend uh, take the time and find the correct uh, socket for uh, your socket wrench and that will save a lot of time. Now there is a rooster that ran after my daughter today so tomorrow we're going to test this out and make sure that it works uh, with uh, the mean rooster and uh, let's make a meal out of them. So thanks for watching and hope you enjoyed this video. 
Until next time, uh, this is a Yardbird chicken plucker. I'll make sure to put the link in the description for it. And have a great day.